Hi, I'm Roscoe from Buckhead, Oregon, and I want to tell you a story. Come closer. Once upon a time, there was a man named Jesus, and he was headed to Jerusalem. And as he's going to Jerusalem, he's walking beside the edge of a place called Samaria and Judea, Galilee. And as he's walking, these Lepers are yelling at him saying, have pity on us. Because they knew that this man, Jesus, was out healing people. So as they were yelling, you know, by the way, lepers, they, they got their digits all numb. And sometimes they, they get hurt and they fall off because of that numbness. And, and it's really a horrific disease but and so they're they're told they're cast out of the the city so they're outside of the city and jesus hears them saying have pity on us well jesus did jesus had more than just pity he had compassion and he went and he he said to them you guys go to the priests and and show them show them that you're cleansed well they weren't cleansed yet but they they said okay so they went to the priest and as they're going to the priest they were healed completely well one only one of the nine uh, i'm sorry one of the ten went back and said thank you remember when you were growing up you were told say thank you what do you say and so you say thank you for the ice cream cone thank you for dinner Thank you for this. Thank you for the Christmas gift. Well, only one out of the ten came back and said, Thank you for healing me. And, and Jesus said, Because of your faith, because you believe, you are healed. Oh, that was so cool. What a great story. You know, a lot of times, we, you and I, we are grateful, or we have this feeling inside of gratitude, but we don't share it. We forget. We forget to say, hey, thank you for your support. I mean, for you and what you've done. Thank you. That's called gratitude. So, in a few days, you're going to be celebrating Thanksgiving. Do you know what that means? That means it's a time to be grateful. And we should be doing that every day, right? But I want to encourage you to remember to say thank you to your friends and your family. And say, thank you for cooking the meal. Thank you for loving me even when I'm not lovable. There's a lot of things you can thank people for. And also, don't forget to say, thank you, God, because you gave me life <gasps> and breath. Well, it's nice chatting with you. Till next time, and happy Thanksgiving to you. Bye.